Hey again, guys. I hope you miss thrifting and style videos as much as I have the past few weeks. We have done all kinds of videos, but no clothing videos. And I hope you're as desperate as I am because I need to get my hands on some clothes. I went thrifting on Monday and I just had to share it with you because so my thrift stores on Mondays, they do sales. They do like 50% off certain colors, 99 cents on other colors. And I mean, let me just show you. Let me just show you. <laughs> Isn't that crazy? So I went to two Goodwills. Um, one, the first one, I spent $108. Um, I went to town. There were so many good pieces there. And then the second Goodwill, the next town over, I spent 30. Um, I went later in the day to the second one. So I think a lot of the sale items have already been picked through, which is fine. Let's dig in. Let's see what I got. All right, y'all. I dumped everything out. I made a huge mess. I just washed and folded all this. And then I just threw it on a big pile on my floor. So is what it is. First off, this sweatshirt. I don't know what brand it is. Los Angeles Lovers, I think. Um, last time I went thrifting, I bought this old vintage Hanes sweatshirt that I thought would just be so perfect. It was the same color. Guys, and everyone talks about like, oh, these so broken in sweatshirts, blah, blah, blah. The wrist, they, it was a size extra large because I wanted it roomy. The wrist holes were like this big. Like I had to like squeeze my arm through it. It was too much. So I saw this. It was one of the dollar things and I was like, done. Big, roomy, comfy sweatshirt. Also, <laughs> my pants. Um, there's some Nike um, pants, but they're wide leg. Let me show because I don't feel like standing up. So they're like wide leg Nikes. Comfy, cozy. These were like $5. So I'm in my first item right here. Let's dig in. I will tell you. So some of the items I bought for myself, some of the other items I bought for my daughters. And also, I think a lot of y'all know, I sell a lot of clothes on Poshmark because I love to buy clothes and my closet is full of clothes and I've been doing some massive, massive decluttering. So I sell a lot of my clothes on Poshmark. So when I go shopping, I shop for myself, but I also keep that in mind. If I see like a great brand at a great price, I'm gonna snatch it. I'm gonna see if my daughters want it first. If they don't, I'm gonna put on Poshmark. So anything you see here or anything you've seen me wear, it might be on Poshmark because I like to I'm, I like to cycle, cycle through my clothes, except for my little key pieces I keep forever. All right, the first thing I got, look at this jacket. UBU. I looked it up. These jackets are like two or three hundred dollars. Um, and this is more of a tamer jacket from UBU. Like they're really funky and crazy and they're kind of fun. They, um, but this is like more like a blazer type jacket, but it's lime green and it's kind of like corduroy. So cute. Next, I found these trousers and at first they, there was no tag. And so I was like, what are they? Like, they're just like trousers. They got this is like a velvety floral on there. So I dug through the pants and actually found that they're Shein, which I was shocked by because they look like they're well made. They're size large. <laughs> I'm not a fan of Shein, Shein, Shein. Um, but these were just so cute. So figured I'd grab these. These jeans do not fit me, but um, Driftwood, they are gorgeous. I looked them up. They're like $200 jeans. Look at this on the side. I don't know if Rainier will want them. Um, they're size 27, so not my size, but for like six, seven dollars, I had to pick them up. So we'll see if Rainier wants them. If not, they'll have to go on Poshmark, but I just thought they were so cute. Oh, I love them. This was one of the dollar items. It is, I don't know. I've never heard of that brand, Bershka. My husband makes fun of me often because I am terrible at pronouncing things, but I just thought we're going on a trip, like, you know, for like beach or like wear this with like a high-waisted skirt. I don't know if I have it in me. It's a medium, so it might not fit, but I just thought for a dollar, that was so cute. This was random. They were also a dollar. I guess all my dollar stuff might be on top. I've never heard of this brand, Joseph Ribkoff. But I looked it up, like they're like $200 pants. Um, 
they're leggings so they're really really thick leggings and they have like this floral design going down in um they are my size they're size 10 so i'm gonna try them on i don't know if i'll keep them we'll see i do like them i just don't have a corporate job anymore so i don't really dress up so they might stay in my closet for a while i might filter through them or i might try to find a way to dress them more casually because they look like something you'd wear like into an office but i thought they were super cute and expensive pants for a dollar like sign me up i love a good deal Ooh, this oh again i hope this looks good on me i was thinking for our trip that we're going on um it's free people it's my favorite. I love free people. I like if it's free people for anywhere from extra small to two XL, I'm gonna buy it because I love. I like that vibe. That is my vibe. I just love it. Anyway, so it's this dress. Look at the side cutouts. I don't know, y'all. I'm trying to own the body that I have, but that it might be too much. But wouldn't that be so cute? Oh my gosh. We'll see. This was another random. Um. It was like $6.99 or something. <clears throat> this coat right here, I don't know if you can tell. I love Aztec print. I know it's not in fashion. I know. I don't care. I love a good Aztec print. I love a good jacket. I just thought it was so, it's so soft. Um, David Paul, New York. Um, made in the USA out of Italian fabrics. I don't know, but it looked so cute. And fun so I had to try it another dollar find Hollister <laughs> um, more for my daughter I thought she would like that um, just a cute little skirt throw a little crop on top and it would be adorable so, um couple randoms um, I I'm not a spanks wear like my body is my body but also I get it like you want to look cute putting on a fancy dress you want to slim down um, I just I don't like layers I'm hot. I'm hot all the time. But there's like a Spanx tank top, size large. They sell really well in Poshmark, so I figured I'd pick it up. Um, I had found one like a week or two ago, and it sold right away on Poshmark. So, saw that one, picked it up. This dress. It's a fringe connection. Again, I bought it for myself. I hope it fits. I messed up, though. It's not my size. <laughs> the first thing it says is, size 12 but then it that's a UK size 12 so it's actually size 8 so it might not fit me but it is this like little mini dress super basic and simple but that color I just feel like it would just be like pop you know like that simple beauty <gasps> this was another it was only a dollar I wouldn't have bought it otherwise um but for like holiday parties I just caught my eye this will not fit me, and I don't think I'd let my children wear it, so I guess I'm going to sell it on Poshmark, but I just, in my mind, it's a, it's a pretty good brand, Arden B. You know, they sell, like, I don't know, $70, $80, but I thought it would be, like, the cutest, like, New Year's Eve dress or something. So, it's a beige dress, but it has, like, gold detailing. It has a cutout in the chest. Um, mesh shoulders and then the back is what actually got me look at those cutouts okay spanx item number two i think i got three total these again not my size size small but they're the um you know spanx is known for like their leather leggings that's what these are they were like a couple bucks at goodwill they look brand new like i always try to check and make sure especially if i'm gonna sell it like you know, everything looks good. Like I do my thorough inspection kind of thing. But I just thought they were so cool. I know people love these. They're great for the holiday. You can like throw on a sweater and throw on these fun pants and call it a day. This makes me feel like an old lady, which I know I'm getting old. Like in my mind, I'm 20, but I'm like mid thirties. I am not 20 anymore. I saw these and my heart stopped for a minute. I was so excited. You're going to laugh. They're... Chico's <laughs> brand. I've never worn anything Chico's brand. Like in my mind, that's like my grandma's brand. Travelers by Chico's and Zero Petite. But I know Chico's does like weird sizing, so I don't even know if they'll fit. But like they're like these like crazy fun pants. And these just like uh, spoke to me. Next item is <laughs> way out in left field. But I bought it. It was part of the total, so I'm going to show it to you. 
Um, okay, so <laughs> it's a blazer. <laughs> And the reason I bought it, as a lot of y'all know, and I know a lot of you found me from her, like um, my mother and my mother-in-law promote my YouTube channel all the time. Um, and I'm so grateful. My mother-in-law recently passed. And I think like based on my last few videos, you can tell there's a lot of emotion. It, it's hard, it's still hard. Um, in January, we're doing a celebration of her life. And if you know Gloria, she wild, crazy, like her outfit, she was bonkers. And that was one place that she and I really bonded over is fashion because she had crazy fashion. I have crazy fashion. And so for her celebration, we've all decided to dress everyone. We've asked everyone to dress like crazy um, because she would have loved it. And I sent a picture to Kaysen and said, hey, I know we've been looking for crazy outfits to wear to your mother's celebration what do you think about this? And he was like, heck yeah, grab it. So <laughs> brand new, it was $7.99. We'll see if he actually ends up wearing it. But <laughs> you tank tops, you can always find really good ones for cheap, well, off season. And so this cute little tank top, I thought the ruffles were adorable. Chaser brand, it's a good brand. So it's thick, super cute. And then this, it's actually a sports bra. And if you've watched any of my summer fashion videos, you know in the summer, I, I'm hot. I don't like being hot. And so I usually wear like a bra and bike shorts every single day. This was also a dollar in the like tank top section. It's Urban Outfitter button up. I thought it was so cute. Like it has the raw hem, it's a little crop button up. It's missing one of the buttons right there, but I don't ever use this top button. So I'm just gonna re-sew it right here because that is unnecessary but I just thought for the summertime so cute this Target Mossimo it's a little isn't that so cute like a little knit tank jammy pants I almost didn't buy these because they're pajamas but they're um anthropology and they just spoke to my soul look how cute They've got little animal creatures. I just washed them and they're very, they were very crisp and clean and then I washed them and now they're all wrinkly, but I just thought they were so cute. Love the color. I will be wearing these out of the house, not as pajama pants. They will just be pants for me. Another random, it spoke to me and it will not fit me. And it's so sad because it's also small. American Eagle vest. Again, these are also like, they looked brand new and crisp and nice in the store. And then I washed them and let them get all wrinkly. So, but I know like, I love the look of like denim pants with like a denim vest. You know what American Eagle, I don't know if you know this. A lot of, some stores do, some stores don't. You can go to this like inside tag and they always have a date of when they produced it. So this was produced in 2013. I thought Rainier would love it, but if not, I'll see if anybody else likes it. I just spoke. It spoke to me. This. Girlfriend Collective. My daughter loves wearing these like unitard. Hard to tell. But like little bike short unitards from Girlfriend Collective. She has like two. And she wears them often. Like she'll wear them and then just like put a sweatshirt on top or something. But she wears them all the time. I don't know if she needs a third. But this one is brand new. So size medium. I wish I could find one in my size. But... Girlfriend Collective is a really good, like, workout brand that I really like. So, grab those. Right, this was the most expensive thing I bought out of everything. It's like a blazer. Little leopard. It has, like, three-quarter length sleeves, but it's long. There's no zippers, no attachments, no nothing. Just, like, an overcoat. I just thought it was so sweet. It's almost done, guys. I swear. I know. It's so... I mean, it's just... It was so good. And as a reminder... $138 like it's just crazy this dress I don't know if it'll fit me again it's size small but it's Misa brand which is a ridiculously expensive brand from Los Angeles um here's the dress it has the grommets on the sleeve a little puff sleeve and then it has like this like tiered skirt um, I looked it up, a $340 dress that's still sold on their website for $340 that I got for seven so 
I had to buy it. So close. Last Spanx thing. Because this was new with tags. It's the same like concept as the tank top, but it's just long. It's like a mini dress. Um, anyways, you know, things like that. You just throw this on it just, you know. But also, if I say I'm going to keep it, I'm going to throw it in my drawer and then I won't wear it. This I'm excited. Again, this one's a small, but it's it it doesn't look like a small. It's anthropology. <clears throat> it's a long dress, so it's gonna be hard to see, but like three quarter length puff sleeves, gathered waist, and then it goes down, 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 down. Can you see it? Can you see it? And last, another free people. And like I said, if it's free people, I'm buying it. But this one's small free people is random like even i have some friends that are like xl 2xl 3xl and free people doesn't do plus sizes but a lot of like their large and extra large will fit larger sizes because they just the way they build their clothes just seems to be different but pretty dress goes all the way up to the neck but just the way it gathers i think is really pretty and the back it has like these little cut out and then the buttons but it could be yours tomorrow. <laughs> Anyways, guys, that was it. I don't mind, you know, just digging and digging and finding those treasures. Like, it's just a joy. Um, so I hope you like this content because if I'm being honest, it's my favorite to make because I love clothes. I love fashion. I hope you have a lovely Christmas season or holiday season, whatever you celebrate. I hope you feel love and joy in your heart and blessings to all you beautiful people out there. Have a good day. Bye.